How's it going ladies and gentlemen? Today I will be showing you guys how to beautify your Android lock screen on Android 4.4. So let's begin this video. So Android, the operating system, lets you make your device quite beautiful with just a few modifications. A good old wallpaper is still very important as it can remind you of your family, friends, favorite band, or simply look good on your Android device. Unfortunately, most ROMs available on XDA don't offer a function to use a separate wallpaper for your lock screen. As Android is open source, this inconvenience can easily be bypassed with the Expose framework. So this Expose module allows users to see a transparent lock screen on AOSP ROMs running Android 4.4. This is a see-through blurred lock screen that was originally designed by Paranoid Android 4.0. When you are in an application such as the Google Play Store and you lock your Android device, then you turn it back on, you will see the page you were previously in, which in my case was the Google Play Store, in the background of your lock screen. This is very convenient as you can just glimpse at what you were doing before. And the components on the lock screen, such as the date and the time, seem to bring more attention and look much more eye-popping. In the application, you have the option of changing the tint, making the blur look a bit darker, lighter, or no tint at all. If you do not like the see-through mod, you can change the background style to a custom image from your gallery, you can have a basic color fill, or just use your default wallpaper. So enough about the lock screen, let me just show you how to obtain this exposed module for those who have no idea how to get this. First off, go down in the description of this video and click on the link that says exposed installer. And make sure you're doing this on your Android device, it makes it so much easier. It's going to download an APK to your Android device, and you're going to want to install that APK on your device. Then open the application up, tap on Framework, and click on Install slash Update. Then you must reboot your Android device to let it work. After you have installed this Framework application, download the other APK which I left in the description of this video called Exposed Lock Screen Wallpaper, and make sure to install it on your Android device once again. Then open up Exposed Installer. Once again, tap on the modules and make sure that the Exposed Lock Screen Wallpaper is selected and then you need to reboot your Android device. That is it and you should be seeing a transparent lock screen on your Android device. So I hope you guys enjoyed this lock screen. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to this channel and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And I will see you guys in the next one. Kapow!